All right, so we're here in our Active Chat Builder, and what we're going to do is we're going to show you how to create a basic conversation here in Active Chat. And what we're going to do is we're going to use uh, these text blocks over here on the left. So we'll show you how to use a text, we'll show you how to use an image, a gallery, and then we'll also talk about this uh, this listen. Um, block as well. So you'll notice over here when I have my text I'm able to simply just add in my message here so this is the message being sent okay and so you'll notice that I have that and then that'll show up there if I want to be able to create an image all I do is I go to my image block and I just drag my image over there and I can replace that here and I can just use that and then if I want to use a gallery, galleries are great because what they do is they allow you to have an image, right? They allow you to utilize an image, but then they also allow you to create links and buttons here. So if you'll notice over here within this block, if I click this plus, I'm able to add a link right there. And here's the button and you can say click here. Okay. So now if I also want to use it, just a regular image or a GIF, I can do that as well. So let's just say funny GIF and I can just drop this right in here. So let's do this baby crying. I'm going to take that image address. Then what I'm going to do is I'm going to drop that URL right in there and I've got my crying, my funny laughing baby. Now what I need to do to connect these conversation or connect these pieces is I need to go back to my initial catch block, right? This is the, the beginning, the kickstart of this entire skill or flow. And you'll notice what I need to do is I need to drag this yellow button to my block and then I just drag and I connect these two or these, these blocks here. And what I'm doing is I'm going to piece this conversation together just like this. So you'll notice if I hit run, right what it's going to do is it's going to send that off to the builder and it says agent's been built now what i can do is i can go in here and i can put a little delay so you'll notice that i have this opportunity to create this delay up here what i'm going to do is i'm going to delay my second one right so that it gives me a couple of uh, uh a couple of seconds to be able to read this first message so i've got this two i'm going to delay it for two seconds right i want to make sure that it gets delayed for two seconds and then this gallery I'm gonna delay uh, a little bit um, longer as well so I've got my what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go in here and I've got my uh, my weight okay I can scroll down to my left and I have my timer I have my weight so what I can do is I can just wait for three seconds and then I'm gonna connect those as well so I'm gonna have to move this into here and connect that that way I have a little delay and then you'll go to my image and I can delay that for three seconds. Let's say two seconds as well. Let's just delay them all for two seconds to keep it short. So now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and run this. And then after my agent has been built, I can go in and test it, right? To see if it actually works. So I'll go in here and I'll say test. And you'll see Right here, this is the message being sent. That was that first text block. It's waiting a few sentence, seconds. Then you'll notice that we're gonna have our gallery or our image right here. And then the next thing that's gonna be sent is that gallery. And so you'll notice that this is, uh, oh, and we forgot about our, our funny little uh, baby here. So you'll notice that it waited a few seconds between each of the messages. And so now what you can do is you can go back and piece together your own conversation with these different blocks right here in ActiveChat.